Well, I got a very interesting clip to show you. This is a whole bunch of new IFB cultists because the new IFB cult is Steven Anderson. And I'm going to show you this uh, in this clip. This is uh, taken from a channel called Dirty Donnie. Not saying I endorse the channel in any any uh, sense of the word, of what the word endorsement means. But this clip is a compilation of a bunch of pastors in the new IFB, a bunch of puppet pastors, I'll put it that way, just invoking Steven Anderson on a regular basis while claiming, oh, we're not a cult, you know? I mean, it seems that these guys, hardly time goes by in their sermons before they're just invoking Pastor Anderson's name. See, that's why it's been said that the new IFB is Stephen Anderson, and if there is no Stephen Anderson, there would be no new IFB. If there is no Faithful Word Baptist Church out there in Tempe, Arizona, there would be no Verity Baptist Church, there would be no Steadfast Baptist Church, there would be no all the other, all the other little puppet pastors and all their puppet churches. Uh, there would be none of that either, because the new IFB is Stephen Anderson, and Stephen Anderson is the new IFB. They can deny it all they want, but just given how much they invoke Pastor Anderson, I mean, it's every single time. It's Pastor Anderson, Pastor Anderson, Pastor Anderson. It just shows that they get their doctrine from Stephen Anderson. Okay, check this out. The Pastor Anderson's the Pope. Pastor Anderson. Pastor Anderson's not the Pope. Pastor Anderson. Especially Pastor Anderson's in the unity factor. Pastor Anderson. It's not because I'm scared of Pastor Anderson seeing something I preached. Pastor Anderson. And correct everything I'm doing, not even with the Bible, but with Pastor Anderson. That's annoying. Pastor Anderson. Pretty sure they're coming to our church to find out anything I do different than Pastor Anderson so they can expose me to him. Pastor, Pastor Anderson. Anderson. Pastor Anderson this, Pastor Anderson that, Pastor Anderson, Pastor Anderson. Pastor, Pastor Stephen Anderson. Anderson. But there have been people that have come through here that have wanted him to be our Pope. Pastor, Pastor Anderson. Anderson. Labeled Andersonites. I didn't call myself that. Plenty of others sure do. Pastor Anderson. That I believe the majority of teaching, Pastor Anderson teaches, look to him for leadership, guilty as charged. Pastor, Pastor Anderson. Anderson identify as an independent fundamental Baptist church. New IFB or old IFB, we don't want to identify as either. Those that hate the new IFB, they say, well, it's a cult. You have a pope. He's in Arizona. Pastor Anderson. Pastor Anderson is my puppet master, and he's pulling the strings. Pastor, Pastor Anderson. Anderson. Pastor Anderson giving them the commandment, go put the sodomites to death. Pastor, Pastor Anderson. I definitely like the power to influence masses of people. Pastor, Pastor, Anderson. Anderson. Pastor Anderson said, Pastor Anderson said, Pastor Anderson said that a guy saved him. I'd believe him. Even if he goes to a Calvinist church, so I would just leave it at that. Pastor, Pastor Anderson. Anderson. I'm the man of God here. I meet the qualification. Pastor Anderson. 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 Anderson. Pastor Anderson. I love you, Pastor Anderson. Me and Pastor Anderson, we don't believe anything that we say. Beyond measure. Beyond measure. Beyond measure. You know, as somebody who's a former member of the new IFB, I was part of the new IFB for about two years, roughly. And, you know, this kind of stuff is not like, you know, so for the, the outsider looking in would probably be like, wow, they're sure obsessed. But really, I mean, I've listened to a lot of their stuff and I was part of the new IFB. I was follow, I followed a lot of those guys. These guys are constantly invoking Pastor Anderson. Whenever someone attacks Steven Anderson, they always come to his defense. You know, and then you have the case of where Don Romero had to step down for basically snorting cocaine and hiring prostitutes. And of course, Steve Anderson has to come in and do damage control, you know, and pick a new pastor. That's not independent in any sense of the word. It's not an independent church. It's, you know, I've heard it put in one video. It's just simply an arm of his cult. And the puppet pastors are clearly more afraid to offend and go against Stephen Anderson than to actually go by the word of God. And none of them would ever have a speaker in that Anderson disapproves of because, well, if Anderson comes out and rebukes one of them, they lose all their members. That's the truth of the matter. And if they get sideways with Stephen Anderson, essentially because their churches are, churches are filled with people who are listening to Stephen Anderson, so if they get sideways with Anderson, well, there goes all their members. Plain and simple, because the foundation of the new IFB is not Jesus Christ, it's Stephen Anderson, who in turn is built on the internet. Because without the internet, there'd be no Stephen Anderson, and likewise, without Stephen Anderson, there'd be no new IFB. So it's just more proof that the new IFB, led by Pope Stephen Anderson, is indeed a cult. Don't be deceived by this group. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye.